Hello guys, welcome back to Zayden Gaming. My name is Xavier. And my name is Dan. And today, we have my favorite Mario game of all time, Mario Brothers 3. And my challenge to Xavier is to see how far into World 8 he can get. He can go ahead and use the warp whistles to get into World 8, no problems there. But I want to see how far he can get into World 8 because, truth be told, I actually never beat this game. Even though it's my favorite Mario game of all time, I never beat this game. I could always, I would always get to World 8, and I would always get hung up in a couple levels in World 8, so go ahead and give it a shot. All right. So, this is World 1, and we're going to 1-1. One -one. Now, I gotta remember, B is run, A is jump. Yeah, because we're using an Xbox controller, and the controls are a little bit weirder here. So, someone told me that if you crouch on this for long enough, something will happen. Hmm. Look at that. We went straight through the floor. Yeah, it's a little fun Easter egg you can do all the time. Now, I don't know, but I think it only lasts for a little while. Lost the mushroom there. I will let you live. Run and start. There we right. go. World 1-1 one, one down. Alright. So, I forget how to get the first whistle. Not until next level. Oh, this is my favorite thing to do. Slide! There's a mushroom. Now, if you had... If you had a super leaf there, you could actually do a one-up glitch. But as you can see, I don't have a super leaf. Now there should be a star somewhere here. Oh, nope. Just a just a super leaf. No, oh, the star's in that third note block. Oh, there it is. There's a flower. <clears throat> now, in this level is where you're going to have to do the crouch on the white block thing in World 3. Ah. Oh. Yep. Go on. And it's towards the end. So, just get to the end part and you'll see where it is. Watch out for this guy, though. Hello. Oh, well, told you to watch out for him. Don't listen. I got him, but at a cost. Now, what's this do? Can I crouch? Oh! I found something on mistake! Bonus! Nice. Now, I think if you had a I keep on wanting to say raccoon suit. That is a raccoon suit. Oh, it is? Yeah. Well, if I had a raccoon suit, there is a one up there, but I do not, so. Yeah, because he tried to play chicken with the boomerang brother. Ah, and here is the famous glitch, or Easter egg. Yeah. It's not a really an Easter egg, it's just a tip. We. So obviously it's not a glitch because it was intended. Yeah, it's just a secret. That's all. Bye bye. I wonder what's in the box. Hit, <laughs> he's tea posing. And look at that. Hit. 
There's our first whistle. Alright, so the next whistle will be, I think, at the fortress? Yeah, and don't forget, you gotta have the raccoon suit to get to it. Oh, so. but I do think there's a raccoon suit at the end. No, well, there's a leaf towards where you where you need to go. But you gotta get there as a big Mario. So, this will be a challenge for you. Yeah. There's a fire flower. Whee! Oh, the disco waffle ball. Alright, right here is the thing. Right here oh, is the super dry heat. bones. And then you gotta kill that dry bones. And now you gotta fly up and over. Mm -hmm. Watch out, he's gonna spawn again. No, you, you better get him again. Oh no. Well. Well, you're gonna have to try the level over again if you wanna get to World 8. <laughs> so jump in the lava. Bye bye. Alright, let's try again. There's a mushroom? Oh, there it is. Whew. Just gotta make these three jumps, I think. Whoops. Okay. Yes, we got it this time. And there's our next whistle. So now... Right. Now you can do the warp trick. One warp whistle gets you to the warp zone. Another the next, one? The next one goes what? Hmm, we're gonna find out. See all the way to World 8, and there's the trick. Nice. So, let's uh, do World 8. Alright, let's see how far you can get. Alright, our first tank level. Auto scroll. Oh, there goes my super leaf. And there goes you. <laughs> I keep on forgetting I can't duck when I'm a little Mario. Let that one go by. Now there's Bob Oms. Oh yeah, the stars. You're almost done. And there goes my life. But in this game, you, you get actually zero have the zero life. life. Yeah, you actually have the zero life left. So let's keep going. See if you can get past this level. Now, was this the one you died on? Uh, I mean, I did die a lot on this level when I was a kid, but I can probably clear it pretty easily now. Maybe not like an expert, but I can certainly clear it. Getting pretty far. There's a burner. Or as I like to call well, frying. Pants. And now you're done. Well that was a pretty pretty short video. <laughs> Alright, buddy. What do you say to the audience? Well, thanks for watching, and uh yeah, next time.
We'll do something different. 